And now to coyote concerns in Wilton Manors. Residents spotting more of the wild animals in their neighborhoods. But with more pets getting attacked, they say something needs to be done. Local 10's Bridget Matter live now with what wildlife officials are saying tonight. Bridget. So the biggest takeaway from this meeting is officials are telling people there are steps you can take to protect yourself. They suggest bear spray alarms, even taking an empty can and filling it with rocks and using that noise to try and scare the coyote. FWC says the biggest thing you should do is make that coyote scared of you. Tuesday night, the city of Wilton Manors hosted a meeting with the help of Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation to address concerns about coyote sightings. The meeting, complete with props, educating attendees on how to keep pets safe. The closer the dog is to you, the more control you have. In recent months, Local 10 covered several coyote attacks on pets, including Puffy, a poodle mix in Miramar. Puffy was snatched by three coyotes during a morning walk. I was in shock. I mean, uh, just seeing his lifeless body inside a dog, you know, inside that, that the coyote's mouth. Then in the Melrose Park area of Fort Lauderdale, this chihuahua big boy was attacked by a coyote. I was terrified. I'm running behind him trying to catch him and screaming and yelling at him. He wouldn't drop him. Jane Johnston, a biologist with FWC, says there are things you can do to keep your pets safe. They should feel that you are more of a threat than you feel that they're threatening you. And so you've got to reestablish their fear of humans. Johnston says coyotes rarely attack humans. In the last 50 years, there have been two deaths of humans. Coyote sightings have been reported in all 67 Florida counties, according to FWC, and are here to stay for the foreseeable future. They're really not as big a threat as most people perceive them to be. Um, it's just a matter of getting people comfortable with the idea that coyotes are going to be in the community. FWC adds that coyotes are often looking for a food source, so keeping trash out of their reach is really important. They also want to remind people in the community that Florida is home to coyotes and their territory as well. We're live in Wilton Manors, Bridget Matter, Local 10 News.